In a recent episode of Thrive Out Thursday, we looked at the work of three directors, Michel Gondry, Jonathan Glazer, and Frank Budden. Now, Gondry and Glazer made it into features, but Budden stayed with commercial directing until his untimely death at 61. Gondry and Glazer are both revered, but despite being the most decorated commercials director by DND Awards, I feel Budden has become a bit overlooked. He's the quiet one, happy to stand back and observe rather than dominate the proceedings and be the center of attention. So I was a little surprised by how many of the comments on the episode said they'd much preferred Budden's commercial to the pieces by Gondry and Glazer. Budden's work felt less showy and tricksy than many of his contemporaries. His style can often seem more invisible, but if I had to put my finger on what defines his work, I'd say there was a naturalism to it. And one of the ways he gave his work the texture of reality was through the use of B-roll. B-roll allowed for the spontaneous and the unplanned. And it made Budden's work feel alive and a bit dangerous at times. B-roll gave his work an unexpectedness, quirkiness and humour that the work of directors who lent more heavily on storyboards lacked. Storyboards are great at getting everyone's sign off and giving clients assurance. They're safe and settled. B-roll allowed Budden to disrupt that and keep his creative options as open as possible all the way through the process. It made it possible to keep the work creatively fluid and encourage an atmosphere where everyone in the crew, from the director of photography to the editor, had the maximum creative input and influence. Let's take a look at some of his fantastic work now. Come and get your tickets and be ready for this train. Oh, get on board. Get on, get on. 